Hi everyone! Welcome back to Mojo's Money. My name is Lacey and today we're cash stuffing the second paycheck of April 2022. Oh, if you're new here on Mojo's Money, we talk about cash stuffing, sinking funds, um, paying down my mortgage, frugal living, in general, everything about money. Let's get started. Also, if you're returning, thanks everyone. I have a few new subscribers on here and I just want to say welcome and how excited I am that, uh, that this little channel's growing. So, yay! So I've got my little spreadsheet here with the amount from the last couple checks that we've stuffed versus the one that's going in today. Let me zoom in a little. Okay, so the total amount that we have to stuff today available is $544. Out of that, the emergency fund is getting $184. I don't have a cash fund for my emergency fund. All of that stays in the bank. So that brings our emergency fund to $8,636 after today. Yay! My goal on that is $11,000. So we are nearing the goal, everyone. Very excited about that. And I actually did not have to use any of the emergency fund over the past couple weeks, so yay for that too. New car. New car is getting $50 today. A um, little story about that. I got my oil changed and you guys, I had to get the high mileage oil because it's now over 80,000 miles. And I thought, oh my gosh, I've got to get serious about this new car saving. So it's getting a little bump in that. Orlando trip is getting $10. Excuse me. Family trip. It's fully stuffed, but it's still going to get five. A walk on tablet or computer upgrade is getting $65. Mortgage getting its usual 20 New phone, zero. We're done with that. I actually took out the envelope. I actually, I need to figure out a way to delete that off my spreadsheet. Christmas is getting 105 and Steam Decks, it's fully funded. And I think I said uh, that money's gonna just stay in the bank until it's ready uh, to be spent or until they come in or are shipped. And my husband's is gonna be shipped in July and mine not until October, so. Anyways, and we'll go over the totals after we count it up. Oh, trip, family trip now has $828 in it. Okay, here's my little sinking funds. It's been a while since I've filmed, you guys. There's been a lot going on in my life, um, just in general. I know I've talked about it before, but I draw a comic, and I really needed to catch up with that. Um, I also had a big family gathering over Easter. There's been stuff going on with planning for birthdays and things like that. So it's just been, it's been a little busy. But I'm back and I'm going to do some batch filming. So we'll have some consistent videos over the next couple weeks. So very good. All right, let's start with new car. New car is getting $50. So we're just going to stuff a $50 bill in there. All right, let's count it up. We've got 50, 100. Yep, 50, 100, 50, 200, 50, 300, 10, and 15. 300 and 15 dollars for a new car. Orlando trip, that one's only gonna get 10. It's a lower priority. We're probably not gonna be making this trip um, until like, I don't know, maybe a couple years down the line. We really wanted to do it for our fifth wedding anniversary. And this year coming up is gonna be our fourth. So probably like a year and a half before we're gonna even really seriously consider going on this trip. And this red binder here, the only things that I actually stuff on my channel are my sinking funds with physical cash. However, I got some new envelopes that, for my, that I won in a giveaway. And I'm gonna do like a game night with those. It's just like a little funsies thing, so. Stay tuned for that. So Orlando trip has 100, 200, 10, and 15, $215. If you see any of these little decorative hundreds um, that I've decorated, that just means the prop money uh, is a placeholder for what is in the bank. 
I just like to keep it in here so that I don't use that money that's in my savings account and think, ooh, this is money for me. No, this is money for this trip. It's allotted specifically for a specific thing. Family trip, I'm gonna stick five in there. It's, it's been fully funded. Um, we are gonna be ordering some things for it here in the near future. There's like a stick, um, some extra cash in there when I get the chance. So that we have an extra little bit of pocket money on that trip. We're going to um, Colorado this summer as a family with my parents and my brother and his family and things like that. So that'll be, it'll be an adventure. Welcome tablet 65 which my computer can't even support the tablet right now, so. Um, I need to upgrade my computer before I even do it. And that can come from this fun too. Trying to get my bills to face the same way. Make them pretty. 100, okay, okay, let's count it up. Let's see what total we have now. We've got 100, 200, 300, 400, 450, 500, 510, 520, 525, 530. All right, 530. Um, bill exchange coming at the end of this month, definitely for that. Because I do have some 500 placeholders that I made. Mortgage, we're gonna put a 20 in here. Very excited to be paying all of this. Um, at the end of the second quarter, so let's see, we've got January, February, March, that was the first quarter, April, May, June. So towards the end of June, we'll put all of this um, as extra principal towards my mortgage. And every paycheck I've been putting 20, um, there was an extra 40 that came in here from um, an escrow overpayment. And then, um, yeah, we'll just kind of see how it plays out in May and June, if I can put a little bit more towards this. But for now, it's getting 20. So we've got 20, 40, 60, 80, 100, 20, 40, 60. 160 in the mortgage fund right now. And I haven't done a bill exchange on that um, just because it, it comes out. It's revolving. Like I take the cash to the bank and make the payment every three months. So it doesn't really need to be condensed. Fridge. New fridge is getting 105 so I went ahead and just transferred this to the savings directly and I just have a prop holder to represent it and a five so let's see new fridge it currently has 100 200 300 400 500 550, 560, nope, 600, 600, 20, 30, 40, 45, 50, 51, 52, $652. Whew, we're getting there, you guys. We're over, we're over a third of the way there. The fridge that I wanted was $1,800. Although with inflation, that might change. I haven't checked it in a while to know. And last but not least, the Christmas sinking fund. It's getting $105. Also, my goal for the Christmas fund is $2,000. Let's see what we've got. So saved for Christmas so far is 100, 200, 300, 400, 500. Ooh, it's getting up there. 550, 600, 620, 640, 660, 670, 675, 680, 680 dollars. Very good. Okay, you guys. Um, I hope everyone's having a great week. That everyone had a great Easter. Um, that spring is coming along wherever you live. And thank you all for joining me today um, for this cash stuffing. And if you like this content and you want to see more, make sure you subscribe to the channel um, and please like the video and leave me a little comment below if you can. It does help the channel. It helps it uh, these videos to be seen. And uh, yeah, I appreciate everyone for stopping by. Have a great one. Bye.